What's up, YouTube? We're the bill-paying hobbyists. Behind the camera is Ellie, and I'm Michael. Light them up. We get a second shot at this one. Let's see how we do. Better? Yeah. Ready? Let's get to it. This week we have the Rockler humidor kit. We learned a few things from the last one, like we're going to epoxy the hydrometer in so that it is actually sealed and it will seal the entire tube this time. We're going to pair it with this African blackwood, which is just a beautiful piece of wood you'll see when we get done so we're gonna head over to the bandsaw we're gonna get it cut to the right size and then we're gonna get it drilled up and then turned and shined I can't wait to get this one done All right, one thing that we learned from last time was that the shorter piece goes on top and I had done it actually backwards. So we have a thread here, we have a thread there. Those don't thread together. So you have to pay attention to how that works because, I'm sorry, that doesn't have a thread. This cap goes on top here this way and this ring goes in here and then this threads on okay so this goes in here this part is also threaded but this thread is for the bottom portion where you put your special fluid for cigars so it goes that way so this goes like this this doesn't really matter because it can fit either way. But we do need to pay attention to the grains if I mark them. There we are, we did mark them. One, three, okay? So it's gotta go this way, all right? So this is the important one and it's gotta go in like that. So that these threads are on the bottom. That's one thing I learned. The other thing I learned with the epoxy, um, these aren't completely sealed because this hydrometer is just kind of stuck in there. This gauge is just kind of popped in there. It's not really glued in. So what one person, I kicked the camera, sorry, I talked to did was he popped it out be sure not to pull in there where the it actually reads. You don't want to hit that when you go to pop this out. If I can even get it out this time. I know I was able to get it out before. Maybe they started gluing them in now and that was part of their upgrade. It doesn't look like it though. There it goes. Don't drop it. All right, so it's out. So we're also going to put a nice little thing of epoxy in there and then we're gonna glue that in but we want to make sure we do it 
the right way. Yes, because this threads off this way for that sleeve. And we want to put it in the right way, which would be just like that. And we'll glue that in as well. So we have those to epoxy and these to epoxy and these are all in the right order. Let's confirm. I got my lines for my grains there. Threads on the bottom, nothing on the top doesn't matter. That goes there.
So there's another Rockler humidor cigar tube done. Uh, we learned a lot from the last one. This one we did much better on. I sealed the hydrometer into the actual kit itself. We repainted the pieces so that they look much better than the other one, I think. I think we did a lot better. African blackwood can be difficult to turn. It's hard. It's a hard wood and it's hard to shine. You got to make sure you get all the lines out. So make sure you pay attention if you do that. Um, the last one we didn't put together correctly. This one we did, or I didn't put together correctly. This one I did That's where okay. it's supposed to, yeah, she didn't have any part of it. Uh, when you unscrew it, the short side, the short blank is supposed to be on top. And then you have the little thing at the bottom for your special fluid that goes in to keep it at the right humidity. Again, I don't smoke cigars. Um, Rockler should work on this a little bit. They need to work on the kits. Either the kits are oblong or their, blank, their uh, bushings are oblong. They should do a metal bushing instead of the neoprene. Don't like the neoprene ones. Maybe if I get enough orders, I can have someone, a machinist, make some uh, for the right size. But yeah, uh, enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. I did. I learned a lot doing this one, especially with the Blackwood. Please go do something nice for a veteran today. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit subscribe. Don't forget to click on the thumbs up. And if you feel like it, maybe you could share as well. That would be great. We really do appreciate it. See you next week. We love you. Do something nice for a veteran today. I already said that. I already said that. I said it again. Don't be bossy. Don't be bossy. Yes. Okay. All straight, good to go. Yeah? I don't know if it's straight, that is the, that is it. Go. All right. <laughs> You're in like all kinds of angles, so then we can tell very much anyway. What's up, YouTube? We're the Bill Paying Hobbyists. I'm Michael, and behind the camera is Ellie. Light him up. We get a second shot at this. Let's see how we do. Light what? It's the cigar tube. Oh. Could you say that any less thrilled? Light him up. Light him up! <clears throat> See, that's why you're here.